Hey there, fellow adventurers of the mind. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the fascinating world of psychology and self-improvement. Today, we're going to embark on a thrilling exploration of a topic that can both intrigue and empower us, psychological manipulation, exploring the tactics of criminals. It is quite intriguing to discuss psychological manipulation and crime-related behaviors. Picture this. A seemingly ordinary person suddenly finds themselves entangled in the web of a manipulator, completely unaware of the psychological tactics being used against them. It's a chilling reality that criminals have honed their skills in manipulating others to achieve their nefarious goals. But fear not. By understanding these tactics, we can protect ourselves and empower others to break free. So, let's delve into the captivating world of psychological manipulation and arm ourselves with knowledge. Criminal Tactics Known Before we dive into the tactics employed by criminals, it's essential to ground our discussion in research. Studies have shown that psychological manipulation often relies on exploiting cognitive biases and emotions to control others. Criminals capitalize on our innate human vulnerabilities, such as our need for acceptance, fear of rejection, or desire for power. So, let's explore some of the most commonly employed tactics. Tactic 1 G-A-S-L-I-G-H-T-I-N-G Our first tactic is gaslighting. This term originated from a play titled, Gaslight, where a husband manipulates his wife into questioning her own sanity. Gaslighting involves systematically distorting someone's perception of reality, making them doubt their memory, perception, or sanity. Research has shown that this tactic can erode a person's self-confidence, leaving them vulnerable and dependent on the manipulator. Gaslighting, my friends, is a psychological manipulation tactic that has the power to deeply affect someone's sense of reality and self-worth. It is a form of emotional abuse that gradually chips away at a person's confidence, leaving them feeling confused, isolated, and dependent on the manipulator. Let's dive deeper into this insidious tactic and shed light on its destructive nature. Sarah, a smart and independent woman, enters into a relationship with John, who initially appears charming and caring. However, as time goes by, John subtly starts questioning Sarah's memory and perception of events. He consistently denies things that Sarah distinctly remembers happening, undermining her confidence in her own experiences. Research conducted by Dr. Robin Stern, a renowned expert in emotional abuse, reveals that gaslighting can have severe consequences on a person's mental health. Victims of gaslighting often experience increased self-doubt, anxiety, and even depression. The manipulator's tactics gradually erode the victim's trust in their own judgment, leaving them reliant on the manipulator for a sense of reality. Gaslighters employ various psychological techniques to achieve their goals. One such technique is the selective denial of past events or conversations. The manipulator might say, I never said that, or, you're just imagining things, causing the victim to question their own memory and doubt the validity of their recollections. Another technique commonly used is the distortion of facts and reality. Gaslighters twist or manipulate information, leading the victim to question their perception of the world. By sowing seeds of doubt, the manipulator gains power and control over the victim's thoughts and emotions. The emotional consequences of gaslighting can be devastating. Victims often feel a profound sense of confusion, constantly questioning their own sanity. They may become hypervigilant, second-guessing their every thought and action. Over time, their self-confidence crumbles, and they may become emotionally dependent on the gaslighter for validation and a sense of reality. Recognizing gaslighting is the first step towards breaking free from its grip. Here are some signs to look out for. Discrediting your experiences. Gaslighters dismiss or downplay your emotions and experiences, making you doubt their validity. Contradicting statements. The manipulator consistently contradicts themselves, causing confusion and uncertainty. Blaming and shifting responsibility. Gaslighters often shift blame onto their victims, making them feel guilty or responsible for the manipulator's actions. Withholding information. Gaslighters withhold information or selectively share it to maintain control and manipulate your perception. If you suspect you are a victim of gaslighting, remember that you are not alone, and there is help available. Seek support from trusted friends, family, or professionals who can provide a safe space for validation and guidance. Rebuilding your self-confidence is crucial. Engage in self-care activities, practice self-compassion, and remind yourself of your strengths and worth. Journaling your experiences and thoughts can help you regain a sense of clarity and reality. Remember, my friends, you have the power to reclaim your reality and break free from the grips of gaslighting. 
trust yourself, seek support, and never underestimate your resilience. By shedding light on this manipulative tactic, we can empower ourselves and others to recognize and overcome gaslighting. If this resonated with you or someone you know, please share this video. Together, we can create a community where psychological manipulation holds no power, and every individual can thrive. Thank you for joining us on this illuminating journey into the world of gaslighting. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with others. In a study published by the Journal of Interpersonal Violence, it was found that gaslighting is commonly used in abusive relationships, cults, and even by some criminals. Understanding the signs of gaslighting, such as constant denial, contradiction, or blame shifting, empowers us to identify and protect ourselves from this insidious tactic. Tactic 2 Love Bombing Next up, we have a tactic that might seem contradictory but can be just as manipulative, love bombing. Love bombing involves overwhelming someone with excessive displays of affection, attention, and adoration. Criminals use this tactic to create an intense emotional bond quickly, making their victims feel valued and cherished. But beware, for behind this initial euphoria lies a sinister motive. Research conducted by Dr. Dale Archer, a psychiatrist, reveals that love bombing can be a stepping stone for manipulation, especially in abusive relationships or cults. By understanding this tactic, we can differentiate genuine affection from manipulative tactics, enabling us to protect ourselves and maintain healthy boundaries. Love bombing, my friends, is a tactic that can sweep us off our feet and make us feel like the most cherished individuals in the world. But we must remain vigilant, for behind the grand gestures and excessive affection lies a hidden agenda. Let's explore this manipulative tactic known as love bombing and uncover its true nature. Imagine a scenario where Sarah, a kind-hearted and vulnerable individual, encounters Mark, who presents himself as her perfect match. From the very beginning, Mark showers Sarah with an overwhelming amount of attention, affection, and gifts. He seems to anticipate her every need and desire, making her feel valued and cherished. Sarah becomes enthralled by this whirlwind romance, not realizing that it's all a part of a carefully orchestrated plan. Dr. Dale Archer, a psychiatrist specializing in manipulation tactics, has extensively studied love bombing. His research reveals that this tactic is commonly employed in abusive relationships, cults, and even by certain criminals. Love bombing serves as a powerful tool for manipulators to create an intense emotional bond quickly, blurring the victim's judgment and making them more susceptible to control. Love bombers exploit various psychological mechanisms to achieve their goals. They tap into our basic human desire for love, validation, and connection. By bombarding us with excessive affection, attention, and flattery, they create an artificial sense of euphoria and intimacy. This flood of positive emotions overwhelms our critical thinking and clouds our judgment, making us more willing to comply with their demands. The emotional consequences of falling victim to love bombing can be devastating, as the initial euphoria wears off, the victim may find themselves trapped in a toxic and controlling relationship. The manipulator's true intentions are revealed, and they may exert power and control over every aspect of the victim's life. The victim may feel trapped, isolated, and dependent on the love bomber for their self-worth. Recognizing love bombing is crucial in protecting ourselves from manipulation. Here are some signs to watch out for. Overwhelming and excessive affection. The love bomber showers you with constant attention, compliments, and gifts, making you feel overwhelmed by their gestures. Quick attachment and intensity. The relationship progresses at an unusually rapid pace, with the love bomber professing deep emotions and a desire for commitment early on. Isolation from others. The love bomber may encourage you to distance yourself from friends, family, and other support networks, isolating you and making you more reliant on them. Fluctuating behavior. The love bomber may switch between extreme affection and cold indifference, leaving you confused and emotionally off balance. If you suspect you are being love bombed, remember that you deserve a healthy and balanced relationship built on mutual trust and respect. Trust your instincts and establish clear boundaries. Seek support from trusted friends, family, or professionals who can provide guidance and help you navigate the situation. Remember, you have the power to protect yourself and maintain your autonomy. You deserve love and respect that is genuine and not manipulative. Tactic 3 Deception and Manipulation Our final tactic explores the art of deception and manipulation. Criminals are adept at exploiting our trust, often using lies, charm, and manipulation to gain control. They prey on our desire to believe in the inherent goodness of others, blurring the lines between truth and falsehood. 
In a study published in the Journal of Experimental Social Psychology, researchers found that people are more likely to be deceived when the deception aligns with their pre-existing beliefs or desires. This knowledge emphasizes the importance of critical thinking, skepticism, and fact-checking to avoid falling victim to manipulative tactics. So, how can we protect ourselves and others from psychological manipulation? Let's sum it up. Protect yourself from psychological manipulation. First, awareness is key. Educate yourself about the tactics used by manipulators. The more you know, the better equipped you are to recognize and resist them. Second, trust your instincts. If something feels off or too good to be true, take a step back and evaluate the situation objectively. Third, establish healthy boundaries. Clearly communicate your limits and ensure your needs and values are respected. Lastly, surround yourself with a supportive network of friends and family. Strong relationships can provide valuable perspectives and act as a buffer against manipulation. As we conclude this captivating exploration of psychological manipulation tactics employed by criminals, let's remember that knowledge is power. By understanding these tactics, we can protect ourselves and those around us, ensuring a safer and more empowered society. So, my fellow adventurers, let's stay curious, stay vigilant, and continue to learn and grow together. Together, we can create a world where psychological manipulation holds no power, and every individual can flourish. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and share it with others who might benefit from this knowledge. Remember, you have the power to protect yourself and empower others. Until next time, keep exploring the depths of your mind and always believe in your inner strength. Take care.